Welcome, gents. From the outside, a Sigma male's childhood might look like any other, but under the surface, it's a different story. Sigma males aren't just quiet or introverted kids who prefer their own company. They're wired to experience the world in a way that few truly understand. They grow up with an intense inner life, facing challenges that shape their outlook from a young age and set them apart from the start. Where others find comfort in fitting in, these boys see independence as non-negotiable, no matter how isolated it makes them feel. This is a childhood of raw introspection, of refusing to bend to social norms, of questioning and dissecting everything they're told. From spotting manipulation early on, to understanding truths about people and the world that most kids wouldn't even notice, Sigma males develop resilience through a harsh, often misunderstood journey. This explores some hard, often uncomfortable truths about what it's like to grow up as a Sigma male. The strengths, the struggles, and the reality of carving out an identity in a world that's constantly trying to tell them who to be. So, gentlemen, stick around with me until we get to the very end. And don't forget to share your thoughts in the comments. We are starting with number 12. They often struggle to find mentors who understand them. For Sigma boys, Finding a mentor who truly gets them is like trying to find a unicorn. It's rare, if not impossible. Most adults, especially authority figures, see their independence and unconventional way of thinking as something to fix. Teachers and coaches might think they're just being stubborn or too quiet, while well-meaning adults push them toward traditional paths that don't fit at all. But Sigma boys aren't wired to follow the crowd or seek constant guidance. When they question rules or carve out their own ways of doing things, it isn't rebellion, it's just how they're built. This lack of understanding pushes Sigma kids to rely on their own instincts and wisdom long before most people expect to. Without a guiding figure who respects their need for autonomy, they realize early on that they're in charge of their own path. They end up crafting a kind of DIY mentorship, learning through trial and error, following their own code, and ignoring the rest. And while other kids are soaking up advice, Sigma boys are busy dissecting life on their terms, figuring out what works and what doesn't, often in ways adults wouldn't expect. They become sharp, self-reliant, and a bit skeptical of experts who don't understand them anyway. By the time they're older, they've gathered more from their own experience than from anyone else's words. Their mentors might never get why they go their own way, but then again, they never needed them to. Number 11. They step up on adult roles at early age, helping the family. Sigma boys tend to grow up faster than most, stepping into adult roles before they've even fully grasped what childhood is supposed to feel like. They're often the ones who, without being asked, start noticing what needs to be done around the house, whether it's looking after younger siblings, helping with household chores, or even offering their advice on family finances, to mixed reactions of course. It's like they have this inner drive that says, someone's got to take responsibility around here, and they're willing to step up, even if they're still technically the kid in the house. Helping out isn't just a chore for them, it's a kind of calling. They can't stand the idea of being a bystander when there's work to be done, especially if they see their family struggling. For them, there's a strong sense of duty. And while other kids are busy complaining about doing the dishes or taking out the trash, Sigma boys are already mentally organizing what needs to be handled next. It's a trait that leaves adults both impressed and a bit bewildered, because let's face it, not every 10-year-old is diving into grocery budgeting like it's a high-stakes mission. Sure, it might mean they miss out on the carefree fun their friends are having, but there's a quiet pride they feel in taking on those responsibilities. This early maturity makes them reliable and self-sufficient, and although they might grumble a bit, deep down they feel an odd satisfaction in knowing they're the solid one the family can count on, even if they're still figuring out how to tie a proper tie themselves. Number 10. Most Sigma boys attract hate at the early age because of their refusal to conform and question everything. Sigma boys tend to stand out in ways that rub people the wrong way, especially early on. While most kids are content with going along to get along, Sigma boys are already wired differently. They're the ones who ask why, about every rule, 
who don't just do something because they are told to, and who see right through nonsense, even if it's coming from adults. This natural defiance isn't the rebellious in-your-face kind. It's a quiet refusal to bend to expectations that don't make sense to them. But to others, especially authority figures, this can look like plain trouble. Asking why all the time doesn't exactly win them friends, either. Kids their age might find it strange or think they're just trying to act smart. And let's face it, most people, young or old, don't appreciate someone questioning the status quo. To some, this makes Sigma boys come across as too serious or even cocky, when in reality they're just wired to question things at a level others don't. Naturally, this attracts some resistance. Teachers may label them as difficult, classmates might see them as odd, and even parents may feel tested by their constant questioning. But Sigma boys rarely care about winning popularity points. In fact, they'd rather be misunderstood than pretend to be someone they're not. Their refusal to conform or stay quiet isn't about drawing attention. It's about staying true to what they see as real. And yes, while it may attract criticism, it's also what sets them on a path of unapologetic independence from day one. Number nine, absorbing knowledge for survival, not just fun. For a Sigma boy, hobbies and interests go way beyond simple fun. If he's diving deep into something like chess strategies, survival tactics, or the life lessons hidden in ancient philosophy, there's almost always a purpose behind it. He's not just picking up new skills to pass the time. He's instinctively looking for tools that'll help him handle real-world challenges. It's as if he's always preparing for life's tests, storing up knowledge he suspects he'll need someday, even if he's not entirely sure when or how. Unlike other kids who might bounce from one hobby to another, Sigma boys tend to be laser-focused. When something captures their attention, it's all or nothing. If he's into chess, he's not just learning the moves. He's thinking about strategy, planning, and how each decision can ripple out. If survival tactics are his thing, he's not just playing in the backyard, he's actually figuring out how he'd survive if he ever had to go it alone. And if he's drawn to philosophy, he's absorbing ancient wisdom to understand people, motives, and the why behind everything. It might look unusual to outsiders, maybe even obsessive, but for the Sigma boy, this is just how he's wired. He's driven by a rare blend of curiosity and a need to feel prepared. For him, knowledge is power, but not in an abstract way. It's fuel for resilience, independence, and the sense that no matter what life throws his way, he's already got a toolkit built for survival. Thank you for being a valued subscriber, gents. Your ongoing support is greatly appreciated and motivates us to continue creating meaningful content. We truly value your engagement. Number 8. Hyper-aware of adult hypocrisy. Sigma boys seem to come with a built-in radar for detecting adult hypocrisy. While other kids might take things at face value, a young Sigma is already picking up on the disconnect between what adults say and what they actually do. When an adult insists on honesty, but conveniently forgets to mention certain details or claims that rules are rules, but makes exceptions for themselves, a Sigma boy notices. He might not call it out, at least not openly, but he's storing every detail in the back of his mind, quietly building up a healthy skepticism. This early exposure to adult contradictions shapes how he views authority. For him, authority doesn't automatically mean wisdom, and titles don't guarantee respect. If anything, seeing adults bend their own rules or push double standards makes him more determined to rely on his own judgment. He's not interested in blindly following just because someone has more years or a louder voice. Instead, he learns to listen, observe, and decide for himself what's worth trusting. The upside? He grows up with a clear, unsentimental view of human nature. The downside? He often feels isolated by this hyper-awareness, carrying a sense of responsibility that most kids his age never feel. While others are busy believing in authority figures without question, he's building his own rule book, driven by the understanding that, if he doesn't think critically, he'll end up just another cog in a system that often doesn't practice what it preaches. Number 7. Early Realization of Uniqueness But Not Superiority From a young age, Sigma boys sense that their minds work differently. While other kids might follow along with what's popular or accepted without much thought, 
The Sigma boy stands apart, almost instinctively. He's not out to prove he's better, superiority isn't the point. Instead, he feels this deep sense of detachment that makes him question things others take at face value. Rules, expectations, popular opinions, he doesn't automatically buy into any of it. This detachment isn't something he can turn off. It's like a filter through which he sees the world, making him feel like an outsider at times, but never in a way that feels like a burden. While other kids might be eager to belong, the Sigma boy is more interested in understanding why things are the way they are. He sees the invisible scripts everyone seems to be following, and he's just not convinced they're worth following himself. This early realization of his unique perspective could make him feel isolated, but it also gives him a sense of freedom. He's not bound to groupthink or pressured to conform. Instead, he's free to explore his own ideas, values, and directions choosing his own path instead of the one laid out for him. This mindset shapes him, quietly reinforcing his individuality without making him feel the need to explain or prove anything to anyone. He's just different, and he's perfectly okay with that. Number six, they are driven by a rare breed of curiosity. Sigma boys possess a level of curiosity that goes beyond the usual how and what. Their inquisitive minds crave a deeper understanding of the world around them, while other kids might be satisfied with learning that a caterpillar turns into a butterfly, a Sigma boy is the one asking why caterpillars exist in the first place, what role they play in the ecosystem, and how their transformation impacts the planet. This isn't just a passing phase, it's a relentless quest for knowledge that can leave adults scratching their heads, feeling a bit uncomfortable with the intensity of their questions. When adults hear a Sigma boy's inquiries, it can sometimes feel like a pressure test. They might stumble over their words, trying to provide answers that can satisfy this child's thirst for understanding. It's not that these kids are trying to challenge authority, they're genuinely trying to piece together the puzzle of life. Their relentless questioning can rattle the typical adult mindset, pushing boundaries and exposing gaps in understanding. This depth of curiosity can lead to conversations that are thought-provoking and profound, but it can also make Sigma boys feel isolated. While their peers might be content with surface-level chatter, they dive deep into existential waters that most aren't prepared to explore. They seek connections between ideas and experiences, forever trying to understand how everything fits together in the grand scheme of things. This rare breed of curiosity fuels their desire for knowledge and shapes their unique perspectives, setting them apart as thinkers who don't just want answers, they want meaning. Number 5. The Burden of Early Maturity Sigma males often feel like they've been handed a script for adulthood while still wearing their childhood pajamas. From a young age, they pick up on the subtleties of life that most kids either ignore or simply don't understand. While their peers are busy trading Pokemon cards or worrying about who's it in tag, Sigma boys are sitting back, observing family dynamics, analyzing friendships, and pondering life's big questions. This isn't just curiosity. It's a kind of forced maturity that can feel like a heavy backpack filled with adult-sized expectations and insights. With this wisdom comes a burden that can be hard to carry. They may find themselves grappling with thoughts and emotions that other kids are blissfully unaware of, leading to moments of intense self-reflection that can feel a bit lonely. Instead of fitting in with the other kids, they often feel like outsiders in a world of noise and chaos. While other kids chase after fleeting joys, Sigma boys are already contemplating deeper truths about friendship, trust, and the nature of happiness. Their intense observations allow them to see through facades, but it also means they often feel isolated, unable to relate to the carefree mentality of their peers. This burden of early maturity can be both a gift and a curse, leaving them wise beyond their years, yet longing for the simplicity of childhood. At the end of the day, while others are busy playing, they're busy figuring out the rules of a game that seems far more complicated than tag. Number 4. They feel misunderstood but rarely bother to explain. Sigma boys often find themselves in a world where they're frequently misunderstood, and oddly enough, they don't lose sleep over it. While many kids might feel the need to clarify their intentions or defend their quirks, Sigma boys take a different approach. 
If someone misreads their silence for snobbery or their unique interests for oddity, they shrug it off with a casual indifference. They're not interested in justifying their thoughts or actions to anyone. It's like they have an internal filter that says, not my problem. Their strong sense of self means they're comfortable being different, even if it raises eyebrows or invites confusion. They often recognize that people are quick to label what they don't understand, and rather than feeling pressured to conform or explain, they embrace the mystery that comes with being unique. It's almost as if they enjoy the intrigue like their characters in their own story, leaving others to fill in the blanks with their assumptions. This behavior might seem puzzling to others, especially peers who are still figuring out their own identities and crave validation. But Sigma boys have already developed a solid understanding of who they are. They don't need external validation, and they've accepted that not everyone will get them. So, while they may feel misunderstood at times, they simply carry on knowing that the right people will eventually see them for who they truly are, and that's enough for them. Their confidence in their individuality is a quiet rebellion against societal norms that keeps them grounded and authentic. Number 3. Witnessing adult weakness shaped their resilience. For Sigma boys, there's nothing like that early, eye-opening moment when they realize adults aren't as invincible as they seem. Most kids see grown-ups as these solid, unbreakable figures, like nothing bad could ever shake them. But Sigma boys, they're the ones who spot the cracks early on. They see the moments when adults mess up, lie, or crumble under pressure. They catch the way parents might argue, the way a teacher loses control, or how a responsible adult takes the easy way out. And once you've seen behind that curtain, there's no unseeing it. These glimpses of adult fallibility don't make Sigma boys bitter, but they do make them wise. They quickly realize that if the strong people around them can't always hold it together, they're going to need to develop their own strength. They stop expecting others to rescue them or always have the right answers. Instead, they learn to rely on themselves, building up a kind of inner resilience that's rare at such a young age. While other kids might still expect adults to fix every problem, Sigma boys are already training themselves to handle things solo. Of course, they find some humor in it too, watching adults try to cover up their mistakes or pretend they're in control. They see through it, but they don't hold it against anyone. If anything, these early lessons give them a deeper understanding of human nature, and they carry that strength forward, knowing they can face whatever comes their way, with or without anyone's help. Number 2. Outsider syndrome, but not victimhood. Sigma boys know from early on that they don't quite blend in, but instead of feeling sorry for themselves, they learn to own it. While most kids feel pressure to fit in, Sigma boys quickly realize they're on a different wavelength, and they don't waste much time trying to force what's never going to feel natural. Sure, there's a pang when they see the easy camaraderie other kids seem to share, but they're more likely to shrug it off than wallow in it. Instead of wishing they could belong, they get a bit of a kick out of not fitting into any pre-made molds. This isn't to say they're unaffected. They notice they're different, they just don't view it as a bad thing. If anything, they start to see it as a mark of independence. It's as if the typical social rules don't apply, and they kind of like it that way. They might roll their eyes at cliques and social games, viewing them as a waste of time. Why bother? They've got their own path even if it's a bit lonelier. Over time, this outsider mentality turns into a quiet confidence. Sigma boys aren't trying to rebel or seek approval. They're simply uninterested in changing themselves to make others comfortable. They become the kind of people who don't just accept their uniqueness, they own it. It's a mindset that only grows stronger with age, shaping them into adults who know exactly who they are and couldn't care less who's on board. Number 1. They mature through pain rather than support. Sigma boys learn early that they're on their own when it comes to handling life's tough spots. While some kids grow up with a safety net of support, parents, teachers, or friends to catch them when they fall, a Sigma boy often faces the opposite. Whether it's emotional struggles or social challenges, he realizes quickly that no one's stepping in to shield him from pain. Instead, he becomes his own backup, his own voice of encouragement, 
building an internal resilience most people don't develop until much later in life. This self-reliance isn't something he chooses, it's something he's forced to adopt. When life throws a curveball, he doesn't have a cheering section on the sidelines. Instead, he learns to work through his own pain and setbacks, quietly building a kind of toughness that becomes his personal foundation. The irony is, while this lack of support might seem like a disadvantage, it's actually what makes him unbreakable. He doesn't need constant reassurance or applause because he's had to operate without it from day one. Of course, this path isn't easy, and it can feel lonely. But over time, that solitude turns into strength. Rather than waiting for someone to tell him he can do it, he proves it to himself. His confidence isn't built on praise, but on persistence and grit. Through trial and error, he learns that he can face life's battles head-on, with or without anyone in his corner. And that's a power that sticks with him for life. As we conclude, growing up as a Sigma male is no easy road. While other kids may breeze through their childhood with clear guidance and a constant safety net, Sigma boys learn to navigate life solo, developing an independence that most people don't grasp until much later. Their early years are marked by a deep sense of curiosity, a need to question everything, and an acute awareness of adult contradictions. It's a journey that makes them wise beyond their years, but also forces them to carry a weight that few would understand. Yet, despite all the misunderstandings, isolation and raw self-reliance, Sigma males wouldn't trade their path for an easier one. Their experiences shape them into people who are grounded, resilient, and most importantly, comfortable with who they are. By embracing the harsh realities of their unique upbringing, they build a life on their own terms, without apologies or explanations. In a world that often values conformity, they choose authenticity, standing quietly on the edges, but fully at ease in their skin. They grow up knowing that they can trust themselves to face whatever comes their way, and that's the real gift, the strength that will carry them through life's biggest tests. Thank you, gents, for tuning in, and see you in our next video. Bye for now, and God bless.